Action coverage continues now with CBS 4's Gary Nelson, who's been speaking with parents as they arrive to meet their kids. Gary? Well, it was a pretty remarkable scene today. Now, Terravella High School has more than 3,000 uh, students among its student body. Uh, most of them were evacuated from the school, but not before being searched, their persons and their back book bags and the like. And they were bussed here to the city gymnasium in Coral Springs, where frantic parents were awaiting them. But I need all of you guys behind the yellow line because we need to have a controlled order. Anxious parents wait at the Coral Springs Gymnasium for their students to be released after being evacuated there from the active code red at Taravella High. Parents texting children who didn't know much. They don't know anything. They just heard a lot of banging. They're just in a group and police came in with their guns drawn. Students related being locked down, scrambling for cover, being searched. Told us to put our hands on our heads, and they they came us. They took us out of the room. Uh, they checked our bags real quick, and they pat us down real quick. For several hours, everyone was suspect. The two um, squads of policemen came in, and they just told us to keep our hands in the air. Parents were throwing up their hands, wondering what, what the world do. has come okay. to. It's just a horrible thing for a parent to go through to have to see something like this. You know, these children, I don't understand why they're so angry and doing the things that they do. They were grateful that in the end, no one got hurt. And the gun at school this time was a toy. Interestingly, uh, the young man arrested the ninth grader. He's charged with only a second degree misdemeanor. Perhaps the legislature will revisit the matter of taking guns, even fake guns, on school property. At any rate, all of this today, the code red, the evacuations, all of that can be filed, the Coral Springs police say, under the heading of better safe than sorry. We're live in Coral Springs, Gary Nelson, CBS. 4 News.